Today we're making an old fashioned gingerbread cake. Hi everyone, welcome to Black Cat Kitchen. I hope you're doing well. This recipe was given to me by a friend and it was passed down through generations in her family. We reckon this recipe is over 100 years old and you can tell because they actually call for shortening to be used. This is a perfect winter treat to entertain your guests. So let's get started. See the description below for a list of ingredients. Preheat your oven to 180 degrees Celsius or 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Grease a 9 by 13 inch pan and line it with parchment paper. Into our bowl goes 3 eggs, 200 grams of sugar, 320 grams of black treacle or molasses, 227 grams of melted butter. For our spices, we're using 1 teaspoon of ginger, 1 teaspoon of cinnamon, and half a teaspoon of cloves. Then add it to your mix. Stir this together until it's nice and smooth. This is what your batter should look like. Add two tablespoons of hot water to two tablespoons of baking soda. Let that dissolve and we'll add it into our wet mixture. Sift in 240 grams of plain or all-purpose flour. Sifting is very important in this recipe because it's a very delicate cake. You don't want any lumps of flour in it. Stir that in to combine. Add in 236 milliliters of boiling water. Your cake mix will look very thin right now. Don't worry, that's how it's supposed to be. Pour into your pre-prepared pan. Bake for about 35 to 45 minutes. Gently press down on the top of your cake. If it springs back, it's ready. Sprinkle with about 50 grams of granulated sugar. Cut your cake into squares, depending on what size you want. Top with sweetened cream and chopped candied ginger and enjoy. Thanks so much for watching. If you're a fan of easy tray bakes, check out my seven layer bars here. And make sure to subscribe for more Christmassy episodes coming up soon. See you later.